morning. This is my day off today, it's Saturday. So nice, easy work is the key. So we got these tiles here from the, they're like an end of line, so they weren't much. But it just make it just tarts it up a little bit, doesn't it? Putting a, and listen, I'm not cheap tiler neither. So these bad boys are just going on. <laughs> Slap them on. It look all right. It look all right. With their concrete flags. So it's just simple setup today. Beatbox, Jenny. But yeah, we'll just get to it. Get to it. Drink lots of brews. I've got a good mix on there, so I can get a few more on. But like I say, I'm not Chief Tyler, but it's just uh, Rebecca's gone out to some art class. Hopefully this will be all beautiful for when she gets back. Got the boy in there making me a coffee. Life is good. Slept up, going up. I think I'll grout it tomorrow, but I think it looks all right. We're going the right way. Oh. Let's get some, some little spaces in there. Yeah, we'll grout it. Grout it tomorrow. Hey, eh? what do you think? Bit of trim in there, bit of black trim. And then voila, it looks well different. Looks brilliant. It's not bad considering I'm not a Tyler. <laughs> it's very good considering well, uh, I'm not a Tyler. It does, it make such a little difference. I've left my little air hole at the back for the for the fire, so that'll go up. I'll get that on there tomorrow. I'll just let it all go off, I think, while it's wet. It's not rapid set, I didn't want rapid set, because I knew I'd be slow. <laughs> It's not bad, what we on? One o'clock? Took a few hours. Three hours? Four hours? It's great, I nipped off. Take us about to art class and coming back and... Lovely. Amazing. Yeah. Looks brilliant. Good job for that. Yeah. Very posh. <laughs> yes. So we are raking out more because we've realised we probably haven't raked out enough. Watching Sam. <laughs> Working away. Looking for hovering around. But yeah, we've uh, realised we just need to go that bit deeper. So I've been working again on this bit. I mean, what worries me is that, <laughs> as you can see, all well, these are just like placed, they're gaping holes, they're just rubble. I mean, I'm not really sure if I'm supposed to pull it all out or not, and then we just redo it as we're repointing, but it's epic. I mean, this is the case probably all the way along, like little bits stuck in here and there. So, I'm trying to get it out as deep as I can. Yeah, it's a little bit worrying. So although it's stone walls, there's a lot of it is rubble just stuffed in. I think the thing if you've got any uh, 
insects that you've dislodged. <laughs> Is that what they're doing? I think so. I thought they're very interested, break. aren't they? In it, breaking up, scaring them. No, they're not fussed at they're not all. There's nothing, are they? No. <laughs> Nice. <laughs> when are you gonna lay some eggs? Yeah. Mm, Stop being eggs? a freeloader. Morning. So it's a bit of a momentous day today. Ooh. Check this out. I'm so excited. It's our first egg. Well done, ladies. It was you, wasn't it? Still a bit warm. Oh, I'm so chuffed. It's the little things. Sam's done a great job with the fireplace. So now I'm gonna grout it for him. Saves him one less job. off with it. Sam said he'd let me do it on my own but he came in and intervened because he thought I was making a mess and I was making a bit of a mess but I think you do make a bit of a mess when you're grouting so anyway it's all fine I cleared it up <laughs> all the bits that dropped on the floor <laughs> Sam was like oh my god let me get in there I had to beat him away with a stick but it's done um <laughs> I did do it with a credit card someone said to me in fact, Sam said to me that a guy he used to know that he worked with on building sites used to just do it with a credit card. And I thought, do you know what? Yeah, let's, let's try that. And I think it worked all right. So let's show you the finished result. Sam's just got to put the grill back on there. The vent grill cover. But yeah, I think uh, it's pretty neat. Obviously, Sam did all the tiling. So, you know, it's all his skill. Considering he's never tiled before, that was the first time. I think he did amazing. And then I've never grouted before and yeah, I think that's turned out well. So I'm now off outside. I'm going to carry on chipping away, removing the old pointing. And I think Sam is going to carry on clearing the old barn. That will be our bedroom uh, because it's not very good weather today. It's a bit miserable, overcast, misty, murky, rainy. So yeah, that's what we're going to crack on with and carry on with today.
so here we go been at it for a while now actually maybe a good hour or so digging out the uh our bedroom still i'm getting i'm gonna get the breaker on this floor and dig it out i might be able to get a mini digger through if once it's cleared and that gable section's down and my lintels go in and we connect the actual buildings properly there's a little bit of stonework actually outside there's rebecca beaver in the way there it's, uh, yeah that's coming down you see so you can see where the corners are tubed the big section and then the crossover so that when that's turned that way that stone's going to come right down here and then tooth it into that building it's uh thanks to jerry that telling me how to uh get it in there nice and snug and giving me his words of wisdom thanks jerry for that one I'm going to tooth it in and not going to use crock ties on the building because I think it, we're going to point it. It's going to look much better if it looks like it was done that way. So everyone's going to have to, you'll see. I don't know. I'm not stonemason. I've never done it before. So it's all brand new. But isn't that what this is all about? This is, this is living, isn't it? Just cracking on with this in the, in the dampness, you know, don't need millions and millions of pounds. Just need to be here building my own house. I just want to show you what it is I'm actually shoveling. There's a corner, it's a milestone. But look, this is just utter wood, mush, steel, it's a bit of absolute everything. Head down, <laughs> just keep going. bit of uh, Irish rain here for us and wind but there's a huge clay section there. the massive stones you can just see them the big ones we've got some out here big ones over there they were the footings of the stone wall which came up to like somewhere like that about that high so yeah let's keep 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 going at it Rebecca's done a sterling job sterling look at that absolutely amazing So we decided today because it's cold, it is cold, it's sunny but it's freezing and the sun doesn't get in this spot so we're going to stick together today, me and Rebecca in the air uh, get through it, get through the section but if I knock it off, the big bits Rebecca's amazing at getting in the little bits you know, it's easy enough to come off see this juicy stuff it's quite flies off it's not all like this but anyway we shall uh, put it onto fast motion and let's get to it
So now that we're sorry about the Jenny noise, the big Jenny. Um, as you can see up there, that is the power flap joint of the wall plate. So what's going on there? You can see the concrete ring beam that's going to go on. I am putting a new wall plate on, and the ring beam's there, so I'm not going to chip that off. If anything, I'll have, I'll have a look more when the roof comes off, but I'll tidy it up. So we found a concrete lintel here. There's like a little section, it's either a concrete common or it's like a, maybe a bit of a pad stone just there. So that's having a new lintel anyway. These are having new lintels. But yeah, there it is. That needs chipping off. out this morning <laughs> I'm not sure the hens well they won't have ever seen snow Let's see if they want to come out oh, come out ladies you might be better off in there to be fair even on a snowy day let's see Good girls. Look at this. Third egg now. Well done, ladies. Cats are having a good play. Let's see what Toby's up to. Toby! Come on, here he comes. Hey! Morning! Oh. Not liking this snow. What's this? Go and get your carrot. Come on. Oh. So yeah, snowy morning. I don't think we're gonna get any more done today. Sam said he might go inside and do a bit more clearing out of the house, but we're gonna leave it there for this week. We're gonna go and have some sledging time with the kids, but I'll just show you where we've got up to with this side of the wall with clearing out the, um, the old mortar. The top bit, the cement, Sam struggled, we couldn't get it off. I don't really know. We, we need to get a new breaker because the breaker we pulled out of the box, it's just not working. So we have to buy a new breaker. <laughs> Great. Um, yeah, so that will hopefully get rid of that cement at the top. And a lot of the annex is actually globs of cement. You can see a few there, just big pieces of cement. So it's not easy, but he did an amazing job, Sam clearing this. I know you can't tell now in the end because <laughs> it's all snow but we're right down to concrete on this side and that side where Ewan is it was just all mud floor so there's no concrete. So we're going to hire a mini digger I think and clear that out because Sam's just struggling. It's just back breaking work. It's very very clay soil so it's hard graft. So that will be hopefully next week is digger coming and clearing out the rest of the annex and finishing off more of the removal of the mortar uh, ready for hopefully repointing with lime in the better weather hopefully the end of March April time depends see how it goes because it's a complex process with lime it's not that easy it's a lot of steps and things to follow so we are learning doing a few courses and things but yeah i've got to go because ewan's waiting for me to take him sledging yeah. you ready to go yeah yeah all right so see see you next week everybody bye for now yeah.